Cadets at the Citadel honoring our veterans today with the help of the Royal Navy. During a wreath laying ceremony, some of our nation's war heroes were remembered. News 2's Stetson Miller was at that ceremony and has the story. This Veterans Day holiday, the Citadel is honoring those who served during World War II on a submarine, and they were accompanied by members of the Royal Navy from across the pond. A wreath laying ceremony here just wrapped up a little while ago to pay tribute to the HMS Seraph, a submarine that General Mark Clark, the 12th president of the Citadel, served on during World War II during Operation Torch. This is the 76th anniversary of that operation. And General Clark was ordered by General Eisenhower to travel from Nigeria to communicate with the French during the war to see if they could coordinate with the U.S. Uh, an attack against Germany. To see if they'd cooperate with us so that we can um, continue our attack against the Nazi uh, regime in Nazi Germany. So uh, the fact that they have a periscope of a British ship is a pretty big deal. And the fact that the HMS Monmouth was in town, it was a great opportunity to bring the Royal Navy by with our Citadel midshipmen, future naval officers, and share that uh, memory and the heritage. We've had the great delight and privilege of coming to Charleston for four days. And as part of that visit, um, we've established links with the Citadel and we've come to comm commemorate the memorial to this old submarine that was so uh, critical in the Second World War for both of our countries. Now this is what's called a periscope ship and this is where the ceremony was supposed to take place. Unfortunately, the rain changed plans and it had to go inside. Uh, but we will have more coverage for you uh, on Veterans Day events coming up later in the show. Back to you.